souvenir. Today I'm Willa Blow. Okay. It's all about killing your TV. Because radio did it once, but Willa Blow, Willa Blow's gonna do it twice. Today, Philip is gonna come to an end. Now I found this TV on the side of the road, so it doesn't work. Um, someone was already getting rid of it. And so we're gonna put it to a, a new use. You know, we're really recycling it. We're gonna see what happens. Put some charges straight up in your TV. It'll be char char charging. We won't charge you for it. We won't. The average American watches five hours and four minutes of television every single day. But you won't be watching any more TV on this guy. <laughs> it's getting a bonus. Nice power. It's grounded. <laughs> television was actually invented by a guy named Philo Farnsworth, who is 21 years old. He invented the TV in 1927, and he'd actually lived in a house without electricity for the first 14 years of his life. Yeah, look at that. You know, he's only 21. He created the television. Good for Philo. I didn't give my percentage. I think this TV is going to block 63.7%. Yeah, that's what I think. 63.7%. I think I think the majority of the, I've seen inside a TV before. A lot of glass. There's actually a whole like metal framing thing going on in there. I think the front half of this is gonna really take the majority of the of the, of the actual shock wave, like the blow. But um, I think there'll, there'll still be some pieces left. Uh, but it will not be usable by any standard. So 63.7%. That's what I think. Mr. Rogers, your friendly neighbor, saved public television by speaking to Congress. He got the budget raised from $9 million to $22 million, allowing him to keep his program going. Which I think is pretty cool because I really liked Mr. Rogers when I was a kid. And it was, what was his quote? It was like, it's good, it's good to be your neighbor or it's good to be your... He talked to kids like they weren't kids. That was the key of the show <laughs> is that he didn't talk to kids, he didn't belittle them. Oh, gotcha. So I'm not gonna belittle you guys. And I'm gonna let you know, today, we're gonna be blowing up this TV. But we don't know how it's gonna blow. So the question always is, will it blow? All right, we're gonna go, we're gonna go TV on three. All right, executive decision has been made. One and two, it is gonna happen. I'm gonna go across all four, all right? In three, two, one, TV! God. Holy sh wowzers. Did it blow? Oh my god! 63.7% was the wrong estimation. Wow! 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 I was totally wrong. 100%. This thing is like crispy and loud. Like. <laughs> I mean, wow, like, I mean, there is the other half of the TV, so. It's still crack. It's still like crispy, it's still. That's the circuit board right there, that's, that's the thing that makes it, you know, all the magic happen right there. Over here, our outer casing, that was part of the TV at one point in time. Got another little piece right here. Okay, I'm gonna go ahead and reassess and I'm gonna say that's, I mean, just, just take a look. I mean, look at the TV. I mean, this was the most solid thing that we had today. I mean, I was most concerned about the television. I would go ahead and say that is a solid A. I'm gonna give that a 95%. There's really not much left to that TV to be blown up. I mean, 
there's a little bit of like structural integrity right around like the front of it like kind of around that casing but every other piece is literally in pieces uh i'm gonna go ahead and say that youtube definitely killed the tv star this thing totally got blown up Thank you so much for watching. If you like this video, go ahead and give us a thumbs up and let us know in the comment section below what you want to see blow up in our next episodes. And subscribe! We have new videos every week and we want to make sure you never miss a single Will It Blow video. Also, we couldn't have made this possible without the help from our professional stuntmen, James and Matt. Their information is in the description below and we'll see you really soon.